Alright, welcome back everybody to the Morpha Project. Um, so today we're going to be working on the grass part of it. So, uh, no worries there, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, uh, let's get started on this. I think it will be, but, uh, you know, can always wait for another time. Just need to get this thing up and running. The main I showed that, oh, uh, I dab, uh, well, look at that. Hmm. I'll just wait. Ooh. That means I actually have loaded two times in a row. Oops, my bad. Anyway. So yeah, today we're going to be working on the grass and then uh hopefully, you know, we are ha we are able to get from point A to point B so we have the parts that have been done. But the top part is then fully completed. Probably it should not take that much time of it. But uh, after that I will try to do something else, because we need to actually make something happening. But yeah, we're going to make a quick quick look on this. So uh, we're going to be fixing this grass right here. Of course, you know, most of this grass is not there, but we're getting there. So as you can see, there are some troubles here with the, with the rocks. As you can see, they're not fully done. Ah, come on. Yes. Alright, we need to add some more darker colors to it because it looks like it is not fully functional. Um, a little bit, I think that is the right color, right? If you are gonna go for that, that would be fine. Yes, that is excellent. So we're gonna be doing that. Uh, we need to actually make sure that we have it like this. Yes. Like so. And then uh, right here needs to be more. So we need to also add some more darker color to it. And that should work. A little more darker. There you go. And then right over here it needs to be done twice. And that should work. If I'm correct, it is now fully functional. Awesome. Why is the gum always good? Why is the gum always there? Like, you know, if you have the gum it on 50% it's always there, but if you put on the other one, it is not. Ah, alright. So we have a problem here. All right, cool. Problem is easily fixed. Don't get me wrong here. We have now put everything to black. So now that should work. There you go. I knew there was something off there. I just didn't know what. It looks like the uh, drawing has been done by a different color than the one that I actually had to use. So that is now fully done. We can now get to the grass part, which is this part right here. Which is the bottom part, right? Yes, it is. But where is in the grass part? Grass bit is... Hmm. It's up then. No. <sighs> Time to look for it then. Uh, yes. Alright, so this is the grass part, right? Yes, this is the grass part. I need to now work on this part right here, and we're gonna be going upwards to that point of view. So now I need to actually make sure that I have this on transparent, otherwise, I won't be able to see where I go. Double check. This is the grass part, right? Yes. Alright. Good layer, good layer. So we can now work around with going here. Gonna be switching back to this. Gonna be switching back to, let's see if everything is correct. 
Mm. Likely so. Is it correct? Yes, it is correct. All right, good. I needed to double check if the uh, if the if the um, if the place was actually correct in, in the first place. But yeah, first things first, we need to add some grass. So most likely, you know, grass is like a very little component that needs to be done to create this kind of effect that needs to be alive, you know. Not every place needs to have a lot of grass, but this place needs to have some grass to create some field of dead, or well, at least, you know, create some effect that I like to have in this, uh, in these rocks. So it is not only rocks you see. Let's put it that way. Of course, you know, most of this is all repetitive work, but it is important that we are understanding what and how things work around. Like, for instance, here, we can put some grass down. And we don't have to worry about any of the parts that are already taken. For instance, right here, the rocks here, they have already been taken, but we don't have to be worried that much about them. And we can even say, like, well, um, what we could do is not use grass on the rocks so we have grass right here and then have that grass represent around the rock therefore you know we're creating something like um, some grass that is not uh, included inside of the rock itself so that's the thing that I want to make so like this yes excellent so we have like you know more steps towards it put it that way it would be fine so yeah sometimes it's very important to have rocks but also sometimes it's very important to have some grass so sometimes it's also very important to keep you know the parts that we have separated I can say like I can go here and put some grass down but would that make any sense? Probably yes, but... And I need to get this like so... So not all the places needs to have these things. So I need to now get this a little bit more sharpened. So I can see where I do things. And now I can go back here and fill up the parts that I'm missing. Like so. And now we have actually the grass that we want. And we can put that grass to use. like so. So now we have put the grass in, uh, into the into the rocks. So it is now fully done. And now we're gonna look for the color that we had. So the first color needs to be... not this one, right? Yes, the first color needs to be this. And then the second color can be that light green that we need. Alright, awesome. So first we're going to make sure that we have that green right where we wanted it to be. And that is in the grass parts. And because we colored in the rocks, we now know how to put the grass down so that we don't have any surprises there to begin with which is great and this is all the parts that need to be done for you know creating the rock slash grass graphics that we need
anyway. I must say, uh, I actually did a lot of work with uh, reading and uh, learning myself the knowledge that I need to learn for tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow, I mean Monday. And uh, that took me actually a long time. I mean, like, it took me almost three hours to get it finally in my side of my head. Like, ah, well, I need to do this, I need to do that, I need to do this, I need to do that. And then, you know, I will be able to get from point A to point B. So I did that. Ah, I see that we have left some parts behind that is not very good for us. Because technically, as you can see, the grass here... This is the hardest part, by the way, this one. This one is the hardest. Because we're working with this grass. And we actually need to have this grass until right over here. The main problem is that we cannot do that unless we have the full uh, drawing done. So I'm gonna be l I'm gonna be increasing the amount just to get up uh, get ourselves a heads up where I need to go. Right. So I need to fill it up until right over there. Just like that. Alright. And now I need to figure out how this is working. So I need to get this up and rolling. That. And now I need to actually get some more uh more textures here. Oh, that's not good. Let me grab the color. There you go. Now I've successfully done that. Alright, now we need to actually make sure that we have everything under control here, so we now add, need to add the color to it, so the dark and brown color. The darker color and the light color, because that's also important right now. Let's go first for the light color, and then we're going to go to the brown color. And we're going to be fixing that up then in no time. And then right here we can also add that. Boom. Alright, and then right here we need to add that as well. Now I need to get a real, real dark color of, blue, uh, of uh, green in so that we have the darker version of it done as well. There you go.
right. Well, so now I can put a blender in, and then that should fix most of the issues that we have now. I should definitely put this into stationary mode, otherwise I will blend in the wrong places. All right, cool. And as you can see now. Uh, da, 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 da. Come on. As you can see now, this looks like now some decent rocks with grass near it. Which is good, which is good. So we could even technically put it more up, but nah, it's not necessary. Um hmm. I think I would like to have like a tree or something here. I'm gonna be putting a sketch here down so that I can see like what I want what I want to create. So I want to have something like standing up. Oh, this is the plan too. That's not helping. I actually want to have like something like a tree or something standing out here that works like that. So I have like a tree that works like this. Hmm. That would work. But then I need to put it somewhere like, for instance, right here. And then I need to have another tree right here, which is with the same effect on it. So. That will work. Now I need to double check. Yes, that will work. I just need to make sure that I have this correct. So I need to uh, I need to lower the rocks volume so I can see what the hell I'm drawing. And I'm gonna be drawing these things. I can also put some shrooms down here, so I'll do it as well. Some shrooms down there, lovely. Is that worth it? That is good, this is not good. We don't want this. We want some more stuff. Some more delegated stuff. So, probably some mushrooms instead. Since that, you know, mushrooms are good for creating this structure, and well, you know, the rocks are indeed. Fragile. So if we're gonna go for some mushrooms, would that work? Not there.
Yeah, that would work. So if we have like a little lizard now, it would work, but... And then right here... And then right here we think... Maybe. Mm. Double check... No, there should be nothing there. So technically, I could go for. So if I put that, if I put a lizard down right there, I could put that. Would that stand out too much? Probably yes. So no, then it's not supposed to be there. It's supposed to not be there just yet. I will put it then on a different part. Uh, mushrooms can be done. Check. I need something here that I can put on. Yeah, that's actually excellent. Alright, uh, time to put some mushrooms on. I'm gonna put this into the different sections, so this is the misc. I could technically go for brown, brownish mushrooms, technically. Mm. 
Nice. Oh. So we have that. We also want to make sure that we have the Alright, now we have the snail needed. Um, the snail was that one. And then we had this right here. Nice shell. Alright. And now we can see if this works. Oh that worked pretty that worked perfectly. Nice. Now we're gonna go back down. This is the darkness, right? This is the darkness. Yes. Now we're gonna pick up the darkness again. I'm gonna pick up the darkness. And, oh, wait. Gonna use again on this bad boy right here. There you go. All right. So probably what's going to be happening next after you know this whole debacle on this drawing right here, I'm going to be probably doing something more on the background. Yes, those, those black spaces need to be filled. True, but not all the time. But I probably will. It's just for now. I don't know what to put down. So that's why, you know, the black spaces of doom are there. Just as a little, you know, guidance for me to figure out, like, what what I want to do with it. What am I going to be doing with What am I going to be doing with it? And how am I going to be working with it? So for now, it's going to be there. And uh, so far, this is now looking great. Of course, you know, the... The black spaces are not going to be very helpful to go with, and yeah, they need to be fixed. Uh, but they will be fixed afterwards, and I will figure out like what they're going to be doing. But for now, um, so uh, tomorrow we're going to be focusing on this bad boy over here. So we're going to be fixing 
this part on the right side and we're going to be fixing yeah we're going to be fixing this part on the right side hopefully that will uh, leave us with not a lot of problems and then the day afterwards we're going to be fixing that part up and then we're going to be working around with uh, fixing uh, and then we're going to be looking at this part right here that we're going to be drawing all right um uh, that's 30 minutes in, but uh, I am not gonna be I'm not gonna be uh, feeling uh, good to uh, work forwards because you know this is a huge part, so this is a huge part of the background, and I'm not feeling confident to uh, get it done, uh, getting this part done. So um, yeah. I just wanted to say that uh, most of this, uh, most of these, ba ba uh, most of these, back uh, most of these dark places are probably going to be fixed later on. So no worries upon that. And uh, I hope you all have enjoyed for today. Um, I think I was a little bit too silent, but uh, <laughs> it happens when I try to focus on massively on those rocks. And I can already see like there are some mistakes I made in these rocks, and I need to fix that later on. But for now, we're just gonna be pushing forward to fix it later. So once this, once I drew this whole part, so once I have drawn this all of it, all of this, I probably will fix some of these rocks to put more. Uh, like for instance here, this one. It has too many bubbles, as you can see. It has too many gaps and things, but. I'm um, going to be probably fixing that by putting more dark uh, colors into it, more dark rock colors into it and then it will create more shaping. Um, so yeah, um, I hope you all have enjoyed for today and uh, thanks all for watching and I hope I'll see you all next time. Until then, I wish you all a lovely day. Bye!